All right, Salak, yeah, man. Fucking Satan. These fucking demon bitches, man. All right? So, back to verse 72. For they shall waste and take away their goods and cast them out of their houses. Then shall it be known who am I chosen, and they shall be tried as the gold in the fire, man. They will be tried as the gold in the fire. You know? Here you, my beloved, say to the Lord, Behold, the days of trouble are at hand, but I will deliver you from the same. Be not afraid, neither doubt, for the most size your guide, man. So, how about Shemi Osha is your guide, man? You know, you're not, you're not supposed to be afraid. But we're in the flesh, we're going to be afraid. But but the most size your guide, man. That's a, that's, that's a, <coughs> that's a beautiful thing. All right? He's going to be our guide when all hell breaks loose, man. When this shit goes down. Hey, man, like I was watching them old 9 11 videos downtown. You know, shit uh, sends chills down your spine, man. You know, you're looking at that footage, and you see these people bugging out, man. These people are bugging the hell out. You know, they're yelling and screaming, don't know what the hell's going on. You know what I'm saying? I was watching those videos, man, when the plane hit and the buildings fell, man. People are bugging the hell out, man. It's gonna be a, a, a hundredfold of that, man. It's gonna be nationwide, it's gonna be worldwide. Never mind city, New York. You know, one block. It's gonna be fucking crazy, man. So when those times come, man, you gotta be rooted and and, and just, you know, pray how about Shemuel Shack guides you, man. Right? And it says, and the guide of them who keep my commandments and precepts, saith the Lord, power. Let not your sins weigh you down, and let not your iniquities lift up themselves, man. So, yeah, man. Again, you know, for the brothers, man, to go for me. We're all. We're all just worms, man. You know, we're just, we're just, uh, 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 you know, hoping to be saved, basically. You know, uh, verse seventy-seven. Woe be unto them that are bound with their sins, man, and covered with their iniquities, like as a field is covered over with bushes, and the path thereof covered with thorns, that no man may travel through. See that? A man that's covered like that. You know, he, he, hey, we're covered anyway, but this is a man that. You know what I'm saying? You don't really look at it and, and you don't pray about it and you, and, and you don't really, and you just really don't give a shit. You know? When you commit, you go off your heart aches and that doesn't happen to the man. That, you know, that's what it's really going into. It is left undressed and is cast into the fire to be consumed therewith, man. You know, I'm just going to get one more scripture. Um, it's in the uh, second measures as well. Second Ezra is 14 and um, sorry 13. All right, and it says, uh, it says, now therefore set thine house in order and prove thy people. And that's what we're doing on the highways and byways. You know, and, and how are we trying to set our house in order? Is it talking about our literal house? No, because you're not going to set your house in order. You're not going to have your wife and your kids in order in the society. I don't care how much uh, videos IUIC is pushing about that. It's all out of order, man. It's talking about your own house, uh, meaning uh, uh, the body, you know, the, the different camps and whatnot. And reprove thy people, comfort such of them as be in trouble, and now renounce corruption. Let go from the mortal thoughts. Cast away the burdens of man. Put off now the weak nature, man. Brothers, put away that weak nature. That feeble, timid nature. Yeah, you go off. You know, yeah, yeah, you commit iniquity. You slip, man. It tells you in Proverbs we're going to get. A righteous man falls seven times, man. But get us back up. Matter of fact, I'm going to get that right now. Right, it says... Uh, Proverbs 24 16 For a just man falleth seven times And riseth up again But the wicked shall fall into mischief man So the most high You know, you know yourself You know your experiences uh, uh, You know your weaknesses um, You know when you go off Right When you fall And, and you got out of that Iniquity Or that situation You know How Brakate Yosha And Mosai is still dealing with man you, but you got guys, certain guys that the that, that most like puts in those situations and they don't get out of that because the wicked falls, shall fall into mischief, man. 
You know, sometimes we get into all kinds of shit, but we get out, man. That's a beautiful thing. You gotta praise the Hawaii Shimio Shai for that. Every day, man. You know? Yes, you gotta let go from some moral thoughts. You gotta put off your weak nature, man. That feeble ass nature. You know? Um, and set aside the thoughts that are most heavy unto thee and haste thee to flee from these times. Any heavy thoughts, and then we all have these thoughts, and then we all have these. Things we deal with, man. But you gotta, you gotta push that shit aside, cause, cause there's gonna be some. Hey, man, these times, man, there ain't no joke, man. These times that are coming, it's no joke. For yet greater evils than those which thou hast seen happen shall be done hereafter. For look how much the world shall be weaker through age. So much the more shall evils increase upon them that dwell therein, man. You know. Um, I'm gonna try to find one scripture. If I can't get it, I'll just close it up. can't find it right now um, but it's something to the point of when you pray to the most high pray with all your prepare all your might you know something to that effect because when you praise when you pray to Yahweh Bashim El Shai man you can't have a double mind you know you can't oh I'm wicked I'm this and that we know that man but 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 the point is not to get wrapped up into that to the point of of of, of you just saying fuck it I'm not gonna make it you know, and if, and if you're not going to make it, then hey, then that's your lot, you know, but, you know, we all fall and we all make mistakes, man. Um, try to find... No, it's lucky. James. No, I can't find it right now. But yeah, I'm going to close on that. It was a quick uh, a lesson for the brother, for any brother, for myself. You know, we got to get these things out. Um... We all go off, man. You know, we're, we're all. Uh, matter of fact, I'm gonna close on this. Close on this beautiful scripture right here. Um, stop you. Yep. Isaiah 64 um, and 6 but we are all as an unclean thing and all our, right, our righteousness are as filthy rags and we all do fade as a leaf and our iniquities like the wind have taken us away man you understand we are all as an unclean thing and that's why it's so beautiful to those men you are imparted uh, damn what's that word you, you are imparted uh, uh, righteousness um, but there's another word um, pardon you are pardoned man that's a you know how beautiful that is man we're in a sentence and you're gonna be pardoned you know um, matter of fact I get one more it's in the book of Psalms um, trying to remember the scripture Yeah, this one, Psalm 62. It's a good scripture right here. It says, uh, Psalm 62, 9, Surely men of low degree are vanity, and men of high degree are a lie. <laughs> to be laid in the balance, they are altogether <clears throat> lighter than vanity, man. So from the lowest level of people to the highest, man, we're all just vanity. Most that sets up people and does certain things, but when you look at it to the whole spectrum, man, we're all just vanity. We're lighter than vanity. <laughs> We're just nothing, man. So take that in mind, man. You know, for you brothers out there. Uh, again, I want to say, Ka Halal, La Yahawba Shem Yaw Shai, Dam Yad. You know, always, man. Uh, uh, double honors unto the apostles of Great Millstone, who I learned the truth from. And, um, you know, 
uh, Shalom unto the elect, man. May you brothers uh, uh, get a double portion of the spirit of faith in these hard times, you know. Um, you know, pray pray for yourselves, pray for the men out there pushing the truth, and, you know, the 100% truth and, and charity. All right, until next time, I say Shalom.